welcome! This video will walk you through finding books and using ebooks from the HBU Libraries collection. Let's get started. From the HBU Libraries website, our main discovery tool, also called the catalog, is in the center of the homepage. Select the books icon and enter your title or search term in the discovery tool to search the library's entire holdings. For example, to search for books about, say, distance learning, I'm going to use that as a search phrase here. Add quotation marks to phrases to make your search more accurate. This trick works well for book titles as well. Any print books will appear with the note on their availability, as well as the call number needed to find the book on the shelf. Book checkouts are unlimited, and library staff are happy to help you find your book in the library stacks. Select the ebook filter on the left and consider the most relevant time frame for your topic. For mine, I'm going to filter to the last five years. Under each title, I can select Show More to get a longer abstract or description. If I want to preview further, I can click the title and review the table of contents. Selecting the Access options gets me into the book. If you're prompted to log in first, just use your HPU username and password, the same password you use for your email. You'll see this screen when opening library content from off campus. HPU Libraries has thousands of ebooks from various suppliers. This one is from ProQuest, but you might see others during your search. The description is displayed, as well as the maximum number of pages I can print out. Be aware of this number as it varies from ebook to ebook. I can click into a specific chapter or open the entire book. You do not need to download the book to open it, and downloading usually requires you to first make an account with the database supplying the ebook. I'm going to simply click Read Online as I plan on reviewing the ebook on my laptop anyway, instead of an e reader device. I can browse the table of contents to skip to the most relevant sections or even search particular key terms in the Search Within the Book feature. This shows me which pages I can find mention of my topic and even highlights the specific term on the page. I can save sections of my ebook using the toolbar at the top. Most ebooks have an option to save a stable link, maybe email a section, or even send chapters to Google Drive or OneDrive. And if I prefer to read and print, I can print a portion of my ebook and read it that way. Remember to double check those use limits on the description page. If I want to read and annotate the material here in this viewer, I can sign into my free account with ProQuest to create and save digital annotations. I'm going to close out this ebook. As I continue to search the ebook collection, I always save a link for any promising titles using the link feature here, or I email an ebook record to myself so that I don't lose it. It is also a good idea to sign in at the top right of the page with your HPU credentials so that you can save items within the discovery tool and create a quick list of items you may want to keep. Remember, if you get stuck in your research or can't find the title you are looking for, feel free to chat in with a librarian or schedule a virtual consultation from the library homepage. We're here to help, so ask us. 